Hey guys, today I'm going to explain um, our activity for this week. We are going to be studying different inventors around the turn of the century for our social studies unit, but we're going to be able to do something, uh, I think, pretty fun to do a little research and then show what you've learned. So after you submit your virtual field trip today, you are going to go to this link um, to an assignment. So this is the website you will use. This is the actual assignment here. So I'll click on that. And uh, this week we're going to study five inventors. So if you look at this, um, you are going to go to this website and essentially make some trading cards like baseball cards. So you're going to have a picture and some information on the back. And these are five inventors, even though the Wright brothers, they count as one inventor. Uh, they are two people, though. George Washington Carver, Alexander Graham Bell, Thomas Edison, and Henry Ford. On this website, you'll see for enrichment purposes, if you want to go a little further, you don't have to make the cards, but you can study and learn more about other inventors on the website. Uh, so what you're going to do is create these cards. And so um, for your information that you are going to gather, you have an organizer here. And what you're going to do is, just like before, you're going to take some notes about the inventor. Uh, I've set it up where you actually have five of these for the week. You're going to do one inventor each day for this week. So uh, the name of the inventor, birth, early life experiences, famous inventions, where the inventions were made, the impact on the United States, and their death, their um, you'll see there when they were born and when they died. And so you're going to fill this out five times this week and you're going to hang on to it till the end uh, when you submit it. And so um, this gives you the directions. One thing you'll notice is um, that on this site, which is right here, if you click on this, it will give you the graphic organizer I just showed you, but it only gives you one. If you go through the assignment that I just showed, It'll have a document with all five on there, so I'd like you to use that. And then there'll be something called a trading card template. Uh, when you get this, it'll make a copy. Each day you'll have to create a new one and go get a new one, and then here, save it with your first name or last name and um, the actual person. So the Wright brothers are the first inventors. So you could say Kyle Polano, the Wright brothers, and what you're going to do is create the image here and your research here. It doesn't have to be super long, but it does need to be complete, full, well-written sentences. You are getting a grade here. And then you'll have the inventor and their invention down here. And so uh, one thing that I want to show you is that the images here on the trading card should be student created. You are not just pulling an image or a picture from the internet. You are either going to hand draw or digitally create different using different um, programs. For instance, uh, you guys have, and I have not used it a whole lot, but you guys have uh, Wixie, for instance. If you've ever used Wixie, you could simply create a new project. Portrait would be best. And with this, I'm not going to spend too much time showing you, but you can. Uh, create a picture, a wonderful drawing. Now, once again, my skills are not really great. You might be able to find other programs. Uh, for right now, I'm going to spend a lot of great time here. And this dude right here made a light bulb. So good. My drawings are amazing. So you can use this, and what you would do is if you use um, this, you could download it or share it. But for me, download as an image with the background. Once you do a background, I have this now, and it pulls up to where um, I could copy this if I wanted to. I'm going to right click here and just copy. And then as I use this drawing for my project, um, I'll use this here. You can paste the picture 
and then size it the way you want. So depending on what program you use on the internet, it'd be similar to this. Um, and then I would fit it in and then put Robert Stickman, inventor of the light bulb. I just type that in and then here I'm typing my research. Once again, complete sentences. Uh, for this, if you want to draw a picture, sketch it out, color it, and then just snap that picture, save it to your computer, and then insert it in here. You guys should know how to do that. Uh, with this, as far as the research, for example, if this were um, your person that you're studying, for instance, um, one of the five that you have Lewis Latimer, you have the dates right here, so that's going to be important on your organizer. It said he made the light bulb more practical. So what I want you to do as far as um, your organizer, when you're taking notes, um, you can have, let's see, just bullet points. doesn't have to be completely complete sentences on this. You are just finding some information. And for me, let me remember what tab I'm at. Oh, yeah, I'm over here. And so I would, if I had a highlighter, I would just pull out the most important things. So uh, light bulb, made the light bulb practical. I would write that down and contributed to the full first telephone. So I'd just say light bulb, more practical, first telephone, just bullet points here. Um, Born in Chelsea, Massachusetts, don't have to know every single detail about his life, uh, but you might find some important details to uh, list in the organizer. But as you see, uh, when the Civil War ended, he returned and started mechanical drawing at a patent law firm where they patent different inventions, and they basically give credit to those doing that. So I might say... After Civil War, mechanical drawing, and patent law firm. So those are the things I'm going to put on my organizer here. The important thing here is this invention. And so the site that you have will list some of these things. So he worked with a famous inventor, Hiram Maxim, and the U.S. Electric Lighting Company. That might be important information. And then you will see that he patented, he helped to create a carbon filament. So I would write that down. And that helped to make an incandescent light bulb. You also down here will see that he um, started working on drafting drawings that helped Alexander Graham Bell with the first telephone, and he also started to work for Thomas Edison in his life. So you're just pulling out important parts, and then you are putting that in your organizer. You are going to fill out that organizer and hand it in at the end. Um, back to this. This is due this Friday. Each day we'll study somebody different, and this website is going to help you uh, gather information, and these are our five inventors, Wright Brothers, George Washington Carver, Alexander Graham Bell, Edison, and Ford. Like I said, there are more inventors if you want to explore, but you are just doing your five trading cards on these people. And so, once again, you have uh, the website here, the link. This is your assignment that will allow you to get your organizer on the website you can pull this trading card uh, template. And so that will help you remember each day you would pull this and save it. It'll make a copy and save it as uh, with your first name, last name, and then the actual uh, inventor. And then at the end on Friday, I will tell you how to submit it and share it with me. You'll have five of these cards and you will have your organizer that has your information on it, okay? So I hope you learn a lot. I know you'll have fun, and throughout the week, I'll walk you through the steps, but the videos, the links, the different things here, definitely explore, see what you can find out. I can't wait to see these awesome projects at the end of the week.